Emily, a vision of grace, glided down the deserted street. Umbrella in hand, shielding her porcelain compaction from the midday sun, the rhythmic tap of her heels echoed in the quiet, creating a poetic solitude. In the warmth of the sunlit sanctuary, she reveled in the simplicity of the moment, a solitary blossom. To create this video, the first step is crafting a story. To achieve this, I asked ChatGPT to write me a short tale, 450 words, of the thoughts of a gorgeous young lady covering herself with an umbrella walking down an empty street in a sunny day. And it got me this part, which was very lengthy, and I told it to shorten it to 50 words, and it gave me the script. Then I went over to Canva to achieve step 2, which is creating the video. Here we'll be working with a video file type and we'll go over to elements to search for streets. Let's pick a street and spread it across our page. Then we'll create a blank page to add our other streets. We will spread it out as we did the first street. We will add on that page for the third street and we'll go over the process again as we did for our other two streets. After setting our streets, we'll be going over to animate to animate each of the streets. We'll be using the drift animation to do this. We will set the direction to go left and we'll reduce the intensity. We will also animate the other two pages using the drift animation and setting the direction to the left and reducing the intensity as we did for the first page. Now that we are done animating the pages, Let's go over to Elements and search for Walking. We'll go to see all on Graphics and select by animated ones to make our search faster. We'll be adding a rectangle shape by clicking on R on our keyboard. We will reduce the transparency of the rectangle to zero. The purpose of this rectangle is to allow us to be able to move the lady out of frame once we group it because we'll be grouping it together with the lady when we move her out of frame to be able to animate the lady this rectangular shape will be very useful now let's position the lady to go out of the frame this will allow us to drag her to come in as if she was walking into the street this is why we are dragging her out of the frame the rectangular shape we grouped together with the lady allowed us to be able to push her out of the frame of our design so we don't lose her in the process. Let's animate the lady by going over to animation and clicking on create an animation. We will hold down the shift key on our keyboard and gently drag the lady to go across and out of our frame this is what it looks like after we animated it it's not looking steady so we'll go over to steady to make the animation neat and steady we'll click on done and go over and copy this animated lady walking into the other two pages now let's play the video to see what it looks like Let's add transition in between these pages. We'll be using the dissolve transition and we'll be setting it to 0.1 and we'll apply it to all pages. We'll move over to the next step, which is creating our audio. To achieve this part, I stepped into CapCut to use the text to speech feature. I clicked on the video to reduce the speed of the video. 0.6x and I went over to text to create a text to speech audio. After adding the text, I went to text to speech session on CapCut and chose a voice. I'll be using the narrative mail. 
and it created the voice and i went over to pixabay to get my sound effect which i've already downloaded and i'll be adding it to the video the sound effect name i got was walking in heels after adding that i played my video to check emily a vision of grace glided down the deserted street umbrella so i cut off this part of the sound effect and deleted that and i duplicated the sound effects across the video if you got value from this video do give it a like and subscribe for more videos like this do have a good one